Welcome to episode 2 of Let's Play Skyrim. Last we left off, we had just heard the shout from the Greybeards, and now we're heading back to Winter Room Helm. Winterhold. I'm going to slightly tweak the game's audio as it sounded a bit quiet uh, when I was editing. Oh. A letter. Like that's it. Well, that was that's the quickest I've received one of those. Uh, nope. There it is. The Skyborn Altar. What? <laughs> a bit soon. But anyway, let's get back up to Winter uh, Winter Hold. Winter and White Run. There we go. White run. This is the. This is what this place is called. Now, quite why we're actually running and not just teleporting. No idea. Now, when I was editing, um, that what appeared to be a crash for me anyway. Uh, when we were leaving White Run, um, wasn't a crash. It was a visual crash. So what I'm seeing now, it's Skyrim is saying it's not responding, but in actual reality, um, it is responding, and you guys are seeing the animated loading screen. So that's a good thing. Just rearranging things. While we wait for us to teleport to Dragon's Reach and then go through into the loading screen. All these loading screens are so terrible. People said uh, Fort New Vegas was bad for loading screens, and on PC it wasn't, as you guys will have seen from my um, cancelled Let's Play. I say, I say cancelled. The only thing it's really cancelled about is I didn't finish All World Blues or Lonesome Road, um, mainly because I lost the save files on a. A hard drive somewhere. No, I don't know where I put the hard drive, so I can't recover it. So, lesson learned though. Now all my saves go onto the Steam Cloud. Or, um, to my Dropbox. Or Google Drive. Many cloud backups. Oops, sorry. And we're in. I spend a lot of time at the market stall so I can learn the merchant's trade. I need more experience if I'm going to. Brought that minor lapse. <sighs> the phone rang. Think about it now, I could have just used the loading screen. Or not. I'll probably cut that out, you guys won't notice. Good. Mm. You're finally here. The Yarl's been waiting for you. I see, this is, this is the Yarl's sword. That he stole. So what happened at the Watchtower? What? Dragonborn. So it's true. Masters of the way. The dragon. If you. All right, let's go speak to the graybeards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to White Run? Yes. That was the voice of the graybeards summoning you to hide. Frongar, calm yourself. What does any of this Lord know? If you really are. Frongar. Then Skyrim needs you. Capable as he may be. I don't see any signs of him being this what dragon boy. There we go. Nor nonsense. Why you puffed up ignorant? These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the first empire. Frongar, don't be so hard on Avanich. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that what do these graybeards want with him? That's the graybeard's business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're Dragonborn, who are we to argue? You'd better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very 
disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They let's just leave. <laughs> He's just gonna keep going on and on and on. So let's just enchant some items. I'm assuming we have some more. Uh, the Axe of White Run. Uh, I probably should just enchant it, but I can't bring myself to it because it's called the Axe of White Run. Um, I can't really enchant anything. Uh, do I have any money? There's some money. Let's see if he sells us anything. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Can me? Can you do anything for me? No. And my spells. So you wish to master the arcane? I do. Let's see if we can sell him anything. No, you don't want to buy any of my things. I'll buy something from you then. Um. Not really interested in this stuff uh, just yet. Yeah, let's just not buy. I, I want to go join the Mages College. Oh, here's our faithful companion. Faithful companion. Right I need you to hold, hold all my. I am sworn trinkets. to carry your burdens. Oh, she's currently has a steel sword, brilliant. Uh, let's give her the axe of white run. Actually, we'll use that. I'll keep the dagger on me. Uh, she can have a longbow and like all these arrows. Axe, a stoof. If I ever need it, I'll just grab it off her. She can carry that. She can have that. Mm, she can have that. Keep all this stuff on me because it doesn't weigh much. Uh, she can carry all the heavy, all the heavy items, so I can bring my weight down to like nearly nothing. Especially the stuff I don't need to carry. Like all this. <laughs> so that's brought my weight down a whole bunch and made her. Slightly better. Oh. There's been talk amongst the guards that you are dragon. Fear not, some dragon or giant. Yep, good luck with that. So, first things first, we will head off to High Hrosh High Hrothka over there. Uh, it's going to be a bit of a difficult journey, uh, mainly because it's quite far away. Um, Oh, oh, this way. It's uh, quite far away and it's got like dangerous paths. Just double check. Yep, use my lightning bolt spell. Oh, alright. Damn those brain mains to oblivion. They want to oh, Why does that even matter? Oh, this is a quest line. I can't I don't want to do it yet. Hi, buddy. Nope. Let's just collect the quest. She's likely we are not welcome here in White So we will be in Rorik's. We'll just collect the quest, we'll do it at some point, I'm certain. We're doing that a lot, we'll be collecting a lot of just random quests, uh, in a hope of, um, doing them at some point, you know? <laughs> Urgh, come on, game. You could do this! Alright. So first, let us... Uh, skip head so it's daytime. Just because I would prefer it to be daytime. Or, you know, at least close to daytime so it'll change as we as we go. We won't be buying a horse. Um, because we can get one free later on. Uh, this guy can't take us because we're gonna go, does he? Do can't remember. Go? No. We will be using this to get to the main places. Uh, instead of just like walking for like four episodes, just trying to get to this like one area. We will be, we will be running an awful lot. I don't have the um, athletics mod installed that replicates the athletics uh, skill from. Ooh. Nurn, Nurn Root. Okay, it's athletic skill from uh, Oblivion. 
we don't have that. And we won't be getting it because I don't want to get it. Let's quickly go and get this this place marked up on a map. I believe this is the Haunting Mead uh, Brewery. We will need it for a quest further in the future. Let's just check our quest trees. We're we'll only going after this one. Uh, she's, she'll catch up. She'll catch up. <laughs> Hopefully. Uh, there's a stone up there, but we won't be going to it just yet. I mean, we could. It's literally just there. Or there. One of the two. But I think only it's only a con like a, a necromancer's stone. Actually, you know what? Let's just go get it. <laughs> Let's just go get it. Uh, ooh, ooh, um, let's do this cave. We can level our sneak. Because there's a blind guy in this cave, I believe. read this quickly because it gives us some quest or something I believe. Nope. Okay then. Oh. No one heard us. It was just lightning outside. Let's just loot all their things. Oh. That's an ingredient. Food is basically worthless to us. us very much, but you know, might as well. Uh, let's loot this person. Not big. Ah, uh, let's take the arrows. Right now, we sneak. Quick save. And we sneak. And she should appear behind us because we're entering a new area. Yeah, here he is. Should she should be sneaked. He's blind. He, he actually can't see us. Okay. Must have fixed it. That's a disappointment. Uh, I leveled my sneak character. Just off this blind guy. Two people, it is. Because he can't actually see you. So when he says, I see you, he can't. He's reading a blank book, which is hilarious. Uh, I don't know where the body of the blind guy went. Oh, there he is. How are you good? Then? So, let's venture further into this. Quite disappointed about that, really. No. Behind you. Yeah, boy, I'm trying to pick imp stools. Um. Gah, he has a ward. That's annoying. Healing spell, apparently. Why does everyone have a healing spell? Jug of milk? Let's not take that. <laughs> We will. We don't have any restore magic potions. We should probably equip a weapon. Wow. We should really probably equip weapons for situations just like that. We do have this one dagger. I mean, that's. Why not, right? <laughs> uh, that's been up four. Just, just so we have a weapon. Just for when certain people run out of magicka. 
search all the things because you never know. So it might hide like a diamond or something. In a dresser. No. No. Uh, okay. Oh, potion. Actually, to give us some quest mark, uh, some map marker. That's pretty good. I do like these books? Uh, they just give you random map markers, so you have like some idea of where you're going. It's actually quite helpful. Alchemy bench, alchemy lab. Sorry, let's just mix together some. Things just so we get our alchemy skill leveled. Da -da 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 -da. There might be an enemy further in here. Uh, doing any of this? No. Nope. Rune books. Come on, magic, a regen. Later on, that will be my my blacksmith stuff. Being careful not to take like everything from these bandits because I don't want to carry it all. He's draining my magic. Here. You see that? I had like a glow around me. Ooh. Nothing just as yet. So it's the wardrobe. Uh, reagents. Wheat, nice. That's one of the mods I have. It tells me what's in a uh, what is in a barrel. Quite helpful. There should be a guy just hanging out on the edge here. Uh, we should be able to kill him with a couple blasts of lightning. Ooh, Lydia. Take that. Uh, hunting boo. Eh. Oh, we can disenchant that. Nothing else. Mm, that's pretty good. And we're done. So let us carefully, carefully go down side of this mountain. Very carefully, carefully, carefully like a mountain goat. That's fine, we have healing magic. Let's continue on. Running to us. Thank goodness. I've been wandering alone for. I was kidnapped by these bandits weeks ago. They locked me. I managed to pick the lock and slip out while the guards slept. But now I'm. Oh, thank you. But I should be fine now that you've shown me the way. 
They're at Mistwatch. Here. If you can stop them, you'll be a true hmm. hero. I have not had that event before. Well, now we know where Mistwatch is. Probably. I think we'll get to this um, the stone at. Oop. We'll get to the stone, uh, kill the necromancer that's up there, and we'll end the episode off for today. Because there is a necromancer up here. Ooh. Got the butterfly. So let us quick save. Because necromancers. Let's try and get some sneak skill in. We know our hands are glowing with lightning. Remember to kill in one hit if she didn't see us. Thank you. And boots. And that should collapse. You should collapse because your master's dead. Maybe not. Why did I? Ugh. Okay. So this will. We can reanimate one near nearby corpses with this. And we lost the mage stone. Oh, okay. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, again, mods are in the description. I will see you guys next time.